Well, here we are, LA Amp Show 2013. Uh, this is our latest model that we're releasing. Is uh, that's out of production because you guys did the prototype last week at the radio show. But uh, this is our Sweet Tea Hollow, and this build has TV Jones Classics, top shelf. We went top shelf with the Zeracote fingerboard. If you can get zoom in right here, we got a little bit of blonde, just a hint on the edge for the aficionados out there. And uh, yeah, take it away. So it's trying like... Got the Ricky, a little bit of that Ricky spank that you would never hear in a regular telly, which is nice. And then. Here we are at the LA Amp Show. I'm showing everybody here my 3D neck pocket. It works on three diameters. And it's two bolts. As you tighten the bolts, it locks the neck into place. It's extremely rigid. You get a lot more sustain and a stronger bloom throughout the instrument. It's really cool. It's, uh, it's something that we worked, uh, we're really proud of. We worked hard on this over the years. Then, Another feature of our guitars that we like to uh, distinguish ourselves is the progressive asymmetric neck profile. So they're rounder by the nut and they get more, more asymmetric as you move towards the heel. And uh, we've been doing this since the beginning. Uh, it's definitely something that put us on the map. And uh, other than that, we use top shelf lumber. Uh, this one here is a, is a really neat build, Telly with a Pal Ferro fingerboard. So uh, it, it, it has that Pal Ferro spank, which is a little bit scooped in the mid-range. So it's, uh, it's real sweet for playing chords and stuff like that. It's it, it just a, a sweet Telly. Um, and then we do other builds with this one here is our latest model, the Hollow T. Uh, this one features a Zeracote fingerboard and the, and the TV Jones pickups, which are great. Uh, we, we leave a little bit of uh, the blonding on the edge there for the real wood aficionados. This is our Comet model here. This has been our most successful model over the years. Uh, it's kind of our flagship guitar. Uh, it's, it, it's very popular with the people who, who own these. They seem to really love them. They're real comfortable to play. And you get that two humbucker, but better tone, really. 
and uh, that's it's been a good seller for us over the years. And then we have my secret favorite guitar in our lineup, the Rockwright, based off of a uh, let's just say it pays homage to that famous '60s surf guitar, the Moss Wright, and. Uh, it's got woman curves, kind of like Marilyn Monroe woman curves, you know, real woman curves. So there's that guitar. This one is really cool build. There's, there's two of these out there. It's a black walnut with a matching black walnut neck. And uh, this stuff sustains for days. It's a really amazing. It's, it's kind of a, a bassy s sustain. It's uh, really great stuff so matches awesome with the p90s <laughs> here's our sweet caster Sweet caster model, and uh, what can you say? It's based on the coolest guitar of all time. But we made the additional improvements with a 3D neck pocket, do some pocketed fret slots, so you don't see the tang on the edge of the fingerboard, and uh, it makes the fingerboard a lot stiffer. Rather than sawing all the way through the fingerboard, where it gets an accordion effect, you do the, the pocket where you leave wood on the edges. It makes it much stiffer and it's less prone to seasonal changes and uh, it gives you a little bit more sustain overall. So it's pretty cool stuff. Not too many people do that. So, hey, what's up? Coming at the LA Amp Show 2013. I'm Glenn Sweetwood. You can check us out on sweetwoodguitars.com and listen to the great interview the guys at the Flow Guitar Enthusiast did at flowguitarenthusiast.com.